Drum roll, everybody drum roll. Yes, oh! Oh, that's so cool! That's great. Okay, the winner for the Canadian Award of Excellence is... This is a film festival. Oh boy, it is like such a weird sensation doing like the premieres. So much. And standing in front of a red carpet and everything. I mean, this is like such a surreal experience. But what does it take to make it here? To stand on the red carpets and stages, to receive acknowledgement and accolades. Well, long hours, impossible deadlines, getting kicked out of locations, spending money, losing money, losing sanity, and losing sleep. It's a game of time. Buckling down hours and making spreadsheets, multiple scripts, getting funding, not getting funding, funding it yourself. Meetings, set builds, shooting, editing, and composing, applying days, slicing out hours, all to make a 10 minute sliver of entertainment. Um, it is such a great experience to have your movie play and premiere at a festival. It is like one of the greatest feelings as a filmmaker because you get like live interactions. Zach, I'm not really sure you're supposed to be here, man. <laughs> I feel that way all the time. <laughs> Last night before the screening, we were all so nervous. And it's funny, the people who made some of the best movies like I've seen in a very long time were the most nervous. How you feeling, buddy? Pretty good. Oh, shit, that's pretty close. <laughs> that's very close. It's amazing to sort of have like a live audience interaction as the movie plays and when it's done. <laughs> Woo! And then getting like to ask people and talk to people on the red carpet. Uh, Buffer Festival has done an outstanding job uh, making this festival feel su like such a warm welcome to creators and just like celebrating incredible content in a way that's beyond uh, thumbs up or thumbs down or good comments or bad comments. It's literally having a live interaction. And for those of you who are maybe a little curious, like should I do a film festival or not? I'd recommend you do at least one. You try it out, you try out that live thing. Even if there's two people in the audience, it beats online by far, mostly because um, it's making a movie, obviously having an impact and showing lots of people like, you know, I have a thousand views or 5,000 views or 50,000 views on a video, uh, feels good. It's a really like rewarding feeling. But that being said, What's more rewarding is having live uh, uh, feedback and interactions. And I can just speak on, on my behalf. One real interaction probably equates to 10 that are messaged online. Not saying that this counts uh, any comments that I've ever gotten online before, but having that real face-to-face -face is so beautiful. Uh, and if that means you just play a little movie for your friends and you guys all gather around and watch your movie together in your living room, I, I really recommend it. Right now, I just came back from our Pocket Film School launch. Uh, we just did like a little sit down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk and talk as we do this because I actually have to get ready. Shirts. This is how my brain works. Things have to be separated before they get put back together. There's a relationship metaphor there. I don't always wear deodorant, but when I do... <sighs> Dressed, ready to roll. Now time to practice speech stuff. So how do you do this? How do you get here? Well, you just gotta keep creating. Get up, get out, and start making shit. I still get so excited seeing film sets and everything. Yes. It's what it's where we wanna be. If you don't have a camera, shoot it on your phone. If for some reason you don't have a phone, we'll find a pen and paper and start writing. Creativity creates creativity. Remember, creativity creates creativity. So just get started. Are you guys excited? Oh yes we are! You do the thing that everyone does. Oh what's going on? It's a camera! <laughs> Does it look like I'm a YouTuber or when you do this? Yo, we're on Zach's channel. Um, I run the ladder. <laughs> a winner for the Canadian Award of Excellence is Finding You by Lily Pierce. This is one of the greatest feelings, which leads me to the launch of Pocket Film School. How was it? We did a thing! People came! Oh boy, that would have been a thing. Oh, oh have you written? Oh, you'll love it. You gotta try it. Ooh, so it's all balanced. Oh, it's like surfing. Stuff. Ooh. Oh. Wait, and then to get off, you can just jump off with both feet. Okay? It's all good. It's all good. You're not gonna fall. It feels like it's wobbling, but it's not. We launched our online film program, Pocket Film School. The turnout was amazing. Now, I don't have any photos on my computer, so forgive me for using Instagram to show these off. 
but it was truly one of the best experiences ever. Now, Pocket Film School is our answer to the gap between expensive college tuition and YouTube tutorials. We wanted to build a space that could propel creativity and teach you what you need to know to make it here. Because it's not about the awards, red carpets, or fancy parties. Now, while those are awesome, it's more about creating content that leaves an impact. So if you're interested in learning about that, check out our online program, pocketfilmschool.io. Before the video is over, I want to congratulate all of the attendees of Buffer Festival, as well as have a huge thank you for those who helped me make this movie possible. Um, that goes from Pocket Film School, Buffer Festival, and every creator you saw in this video. I love you. I love you. Goodbye.